there we go. Ahoy everyone and welcome aboard, I'll be your Captain Hillian today along with... Me, is Might and Lieutenant Drakir, at your service. And welcome back to the Dark Side Detective, a fumble in the dark, which, well, we're going in on the main days as well. <laughs> to finish it up, since, well, we're done with Alien Isolation, and, yep, not, not that I'm not enjoying my time with this game, I am enjoying it plenty, but, yeah, we do, <laughs> I don't want to get back to starting one of our free, uh, one of the, the, our ongoing games, uh, and still be going on with this on the side as well. So yeah, we'll just we're just going to finish this up as quickly as we can, not without rushing it or anything. And yeah, then we'll get back to Warcraft and Digimon. Uh, For now, wait, wait. I'm going to take one. Hmm? Wait, I got a message from uh, someone you may know. Uh, if they want to join in, they can. Beautiful, we've tapped into your soul cavity. Okay, uh, and yeah, it it looks like the game is one of those that uses up whatever bit of your GPU it can get. So that's currently running at 99%, and that's yeah. why, well, this is being a bit stuttery. Yeah, <clears throat> this is kind of weird. For, did, did they not happen in the last game? Or, I think they added a bit of that, but it was something else caused me back then. Maybe. Also, what is this? Narc mode? Snitch mode activated? Okay, but we're telling you, you it's off. Definitely off this time, to he. Look, these targeted, those targeted adverts are a coincidence. Does that not just enter your bank pin? Captain? Hmm? I think that's the hint mode. Maybe? Hmm. They're just being... Facetious. Okay. Koi? Koi is not the word that I'm looking for. Yeah, I think it's facetious. Yeah. Anyway, last time, well, uh, <laughs> something came to save uh, McQueen and Dooley from their class reunion. Only it's uh, <laughs> it's Dooley's totally not dark side boyfriend, who uh, <laughs> doesn't seem to have taken to Dooley getting out too kindly. <laughs> Uh, not boyfriend, they. Yeah. More of a pet owner? Basically, uh, he wants Dooley, and we don't want him to have Dooley. Also, he's the he's bigger than a fucking skyscraper. And I think, I, in one of the, in one of the other flashbacks, we saw a purple tentacle off to the side, which we thought was that purple tentacle we ran into the last game. But no, apparently this guy has been hiding off screen with those flashbacks every time now, and we've been able to spot him a, a time or two at least. Yeah, not only the, we saw also his ring as well. Uh, but yeah, uh, we kind of need him to stop trashing the city. Uh, what was his name? Greg was his name, I think? <laughs> or Jeff? It wasn't Greg or Jeff. It's complicated if it's Greg, considering how how often I use the name. Oh. Yeah, and we already saw that. I think we've seen everything here at the moment. Yeah. So let's continue exploring. And hello, Fern. Fern, long time no see. Hey, Francis. Where's the detective now? Well, they don't make me, they don't make you give up your name or anything. All right. I'm not partying with the others? Maybe in a bit. So I'm just taking the old art room in. Yeah, I'm just crazy to think this is where I spent most of high school. What are you yeah, what are you at these days? I'm an animator nowadays, going wherever the work takes me. Kinda ironic given I'm trapped in this low animation indie game. <laughs> but now you're Oi. playing Koi with the with the fourth roll breaks. <laughs> that was my line. Yeah, the, my Thumbs up, Francis. Okay, uh... Yeah, smells like this has been emptied in years. Hey, that's where the... Oh, God, give me a moment for this one. Mm. Hey, that's where that burrito ended up. I've been thinking about that for years. Come here, little... Yeah. <laughs> Don't... Don't you dare. Do not... 
If lost, please keep it to yourself. <laughs> Useful. Not. Okay. Marv? Okay, Marv, this is gonna be easy. Just say something normal and start a conversation. You know you're saying all that out loud, right? Ah, uh, Marv, goddammit. <laughs> Did you know that the fight... Mm. Did you know that the first fire extinguisher used said petrol? The principle was the same as uh, with angry kids. Let it tire itself out. Yeah, that's not how that goes. Yeah, people, I think you can see what just happened with my brain reading from that sentence. Well. Remember the time these... Mm, remember the time these all spat out chocolate water? A sort of rusty, earthy chocolate flavor it, it had? I don't think that was chocolate. That was rust. I see that happen, and uh, how he... Uh, it's Dooley. <laughs> I always dreamt that when I came back to school, it'd be to sit an exam in my underwear. It was worse. <laughs> Rikita.exe needed a rebooting for a second. <laughs> actually, that's what happened. That's actually what happened. I just... Yes, what the heck did I just read? <laughs> the thing I miss most about school is teaching it. Teaching work is so much harder. Uh, stay at school, you know, kids. Yeah, like, I, I have to work with someone, uh, I won't give too many details, but they basically they were forced for, <laughs> into doing the thing, uh, into working on something, and yeah, they were forced to because they were skipping school, and it fucking showed. <laughs> the fucking idiot that was. <clears throat> It's impressive that they've managed not to paint anything in the un uh, unmentionable number of years since we were here. Wait, so that was un always been grey? <laughs> oh my god, I think that's Victoria, the weird uh, school, let's go in high school. What? Played cool. Me, I'm a travel agent to the other side. The dark side? The dark what? No, I'm an assassin! Oh, uh... <laughs> when you say assassin, you summon Derby! <laughs> Hello, Derby, how are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> what are you just talking timing. about me or something? Oh, you were just talking about me? Uh, nope. No, no. But when Helium Finn is saying the word assassin, that very split second you appeared. <laughs> okay, uh, <laughs> welcome, Durbin, to uh, the Dark Side Detective, a fumble in the dark, where we're in the e lost of the non DLC or non added, whatever. Uh, not sure they count as DLC since I don't. Yeah. Not of the last of the first few. Uh, of the, f yeah, the last of the original cases. There are some extras that we can do after. Uh, but yeah, welcome to Class of the Titans. Uh, yeah, not Class, Class, where these two are at a <laughs> class reunion. Also, uh, someone with a crush on Dooley from, well, the other, <laughs> the other dimension is coming here to crush the city. So, yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, this game is insane in the perfect way. <clears throat> Let's see. Well, now I'm a bank and my bank manager on the internet, so I need to get a faster upload speed. Though the commute is killing me. Okay, that's a decent joke. The plug Sorry. says I'm watching you. Okay, let's check these rooms. Staff room. I always wondered what this place looked like. You've never been? No, it was off limits. Wait, you were? Yeah, I was allowed in when I was dating a teacher. Wait, what? You dated a teacher? That's wrong on so many levels. 
tell me about it. It was for biology. I had to get a teacher's cells and date how old they were. It was a right curve. But... <laughs> okay. I don't even want to know. Uh, pardon? Uh, still somewhat sniffly from the flu. <clears throat> The school's fuse box, the source of all power in this place. All right, Mr. Spider, sorry, I was still a bit the, the old EXEs, whatever you call it. <laughs> uh, everyone knows the principal is the source of all power here. Yep, oh, actually opened it. It's amazing. It's amazing to see what the other half the academy did. It's amazing to see what the other half, the academic elites, threw away. To you and me, that's a yogurt car carton, but to them... Well, I mean, it's probably still a yogurt carton. That's what's a bad example. <laughs> Do we? The car is off beyond the road to mischief. Of course, that's the first thing he thinks of. There's sandwiches, soups, cakes, yogurts, milk, and more in here. Thank goodness, I'm starving. Let's eat. Sorry, buddy. Everything is protected by the law of the label. I know if there... Pardon? I know if there is a name, then that's a shame. Even I will break the first amendment of the Constitution. Uh, oh, wait, the milk hasn't got a name. Let's take it. It's the old West when it comes to unclean fridge items. Of course. But yeah, then you need to be careful that nobody's put laxatives into it. Because that happens decently often enough. <laughs> Wait, what? Both the children inside, please do not release. Uh, some long forgotten jars labeled dreams, hope, ideologies. <laughs> Scrolls, eels, hands off. These bowls are unused, never mind unwashed. Why would you wash bowls when the teacher's so clean they drink their soup from the sea? Ah, bloody heck. You can see the little soup line around the top, see? Ooh. Yeah, that's hopefully something else. <laughs> but anyways, how have you been, Durbin? Sorry for not asking earlier. <laughs> oh, no, I sound pretty good. Okay. Good to hear. The staff microwave looks to be the same model as we have at work. There's both its settings still cold and nuclear hot. <laughs> the pr professor, <laughs> close the door. I'm hiding from the students who've come back, presumably from the dead. <laughs> Confiscated teeth. Do not return any. Lots of sticks of chalk, all either nibbled or licked. None of this usable. In case of emergency, hide in here. I don't think that's going to help when Buff Zulu is stomping around. Is this their wreck area? No wonder they were always so angry. Seems to be internal memos. Tina stopped parking on the sports field. I need somebody to swap classes with me next Tuesday. Attending end of world ritual. Do not, do not, don't want to abandon class entirely in case it doesn't go to plan. Like, like swap, swap next. What? Okay. Not seeing anything else around here. I can't get into the principal's office. I will you want to? I spent all the high school trying to stay out of that place. <laughs> Can't say I'm surprised. <clears throat> yep, yep. Okay, that's quite a jaw on him. <laughs> Score! I knew my locker would still have this old bottle of hooch in it. Really? Also, um, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm dope. Uh. What secret is held? Who had a crush on whom? Who was practic practicing black magic? Who had dug a secret bear cat into the walls? 
who was selling their books on their black market. The black market? You laugh, but you were... You laugh, but where else do you think science labs get all those drugs for dissecting? <laughs> Maybe he has a point somewhere in there. Okay, oh, science dear. lab. Also, I had an evil idea. Yeah. This is this is up to Durvi. If uh, Durvi, if you Durvi want to do this, What's that? voice act Bofulu. If well, oh. he, he probably gets uh, he's going to get lines soon. Yeah. Okay. Once I forget <clears> who that one is. I think uh, you'll see. <laughs> I think you'll know them when you see them. <clears throat> Are these the same equations we see all over the city? At least somebody should have cracked them by now. That's the thing about science, detective. It's not an exact science. A lot of dangerous looking chemicals here. We should consume them to protect others. Or we can just take them for now. <laughs> The sort of chemicals. I swear, sometimes I wonder if I'm losing brain cells uh, voice acting duly. <laughs> they are not actually safer. But way less fun. A locked cabinet, probably full of Bunsen's and Beakers. And Ralph and Animal and Kermit and I can tell from your blank expression I misread things. <laughs> the Muppets. Because Beaker and Bunsen are two of the Muppets, the two science ones. The elements broken down by atomic number, heft of flow, and severity of cramps. What? Fuck. <laughs> okay, what a perfectly shaped bin. Yeah, yeah, something personally suggested. Yeah, yeah, whatever. The monster seems to be searching the city. We need to lure it here and fast. Another fire extinguisher. How many years do you reckon this was a thing with... What? How many years do you think reckon this was a extinguisher before it retired? Because it's an extinguisher. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Cheesy uh, jokes. Uh, uh, let's see. I guess we might be able to use these to maybe melt the lock off of the uh, of the place we need to go. Also, uh, let's pop this lock so we don't get trapped outside. And uh, I think you can see them somewhere in there. Very easy oh. to overlook. <laughs> Hello, giant monster. <laughs> and first, uh, okay. Oh, okay. <clears throat> to find another way in. I just realized, one year ago, or at least, that uh, when they, they, they lost our friend here, on the other yeah. side, that thing was half his size. <laughs> yeah. Um, hmm. I can't really think of how we might be able to get in there. The grab and the oh, chemicals, nothing can you know, go wrong carrying this around. I think I started to see double. Wait, I should ask. No. Maybe it was not half his size. It might have been twice his size or something. He was over a fence, not sitting on it, perhaps? Yeah, oh. I, I think he was sitting on it. <laughs> okay, let's see. It belonged to nobody, so it belongs now to us. Hmm, yeah, we need to get in here. I don't want to flunk out of this case. <laughs> hmm. What's, what's we need to get a key or we need to make another way. Oh, under blank. Okay. Well, it's... well, well. Well, well. What have we here? High school's biggest loser and his pet idiot. Hey, no. I don't believe in pets. The entire concept just doesn't believe it. Yeah. Entire concept, just don't believe it happens. Human only animals. You even see it? It's like Gremlins or, or Santa Claus. I have a pet. You met her. You you have also met Gremlins and Santa Claus. We can't clamp to him, remember? 
I remember upholding the law like a super cop. Working Christmas Eve. Who does that? This guy. Stay safe, y'all. Jackass. Secret. Arrested. Oh. Yes, he yeah, arrested Santa. Santa Claus? <laughs> What's this? Looks like a door detector. Hold on. Okay. Hmm. I, I knew that I was being referred. But you always what it was a door. It's a door. I know, Dooley. I wasn't really asking. A second one without a handle. I can see all that. Looking through the keyhole, it seems to lead into the control room. Oh, the table. I don't know how you did. You. Did. Oh, bloody heck. Also, the table. I don't know how you did. You did get by without me mentoring you. Am I reading that right? About. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Every time you take that, actually, it doesn't suit. Where, where am I going to get a door handle? Oh, that time we put on the MC Escher play with a lot of old doors. I wonder if, ha if uh, any of them are, are still backstage behind the gym. Okay, that's a good, <laughs> that's a good hint of where to go. Uh, big question then becomes, where the heck is the gym? <laughs> Uh, oh, that way. Actually, here, yeah. That's it. Hmm, stirring is usually good for stock. I should check the market. I hope there wasn't some tectonic plates, uh, plates action caused by drilling from the underwater city. I'd be pleased! Oh gosh, I hope Detective McKin McKinney is okay. Rude. Is everyone okay? Does anyone need an adult? You're all adults, you idiots. Huh? What was that? No, I'm still here. I dreamt that I'd met that sweet embrace. Uh, what was that rumbling? Oh, my time mech. Uh, my time mess potatoes are okay. Mm. Oh, that was it, all of this. <laughs> okay. Love these guys. I'm good to all their gang. I love these guys. I go to all their gigs. There we go. No gangs. They're a wedding band, no? Ah, as if I will... Ah, as if I will crush a wedding. Free cake and confused looks. I'm in. Can't say I'm surprised. <laughs> uh, the, the Inhuman League. Baby, your eyes. It's pretty eyes. I could stare into them you know, for an eternity. In fact, I have been. I got lost in your eyes a thousand years ago. And now I'm trapped in your labyrinthine. <laughs> yeah, looking for a way out. Please send help. Horrible <laughs> streams of madness. I prefer the song, How Many Limbs Are Too Many Limbs. I'm starving. I could murder some long picnic <laughs> right about now. It's so weird being back. So much has changed in these last years. I wonder how life would have turned out if things had been different. Girl, you were robbed. Never happened that, that year anyway. Somebody stole the sacred ballot box, so no sacrifice was picked. Should I even... No. What? Uh, hey, buddy, we're playing here. Sort off. Well, that's... A well, that's this case wrapped up, Detective. We don't have the power to remove this lot. Power. Uh-oh. Well, we know where the fuse box is. And we've got some clippers. So... Up we go. Into the staff room. And snip snip. We kill the power to the stage, and that should be the end of the band. No, they were great detective, but driving them off stage seems a little harsh. Dooley, we need to get backstage and cans while they're playing. Whatever you got to tell yourself, that's it, Dev. I was half expecting him to go for a darker joke there, but no. Okay. Oh, ha, ha, you're still gonna make... Because you're gonna... I talk to you because you're gonna make it all dark? Really? Uh, let's nip up now that the stage is free. 
It's like peeing behind a curtain in Oz. Except, except these curtains are broken and don't open. Okay, stack of tape. Stack of various stage tapes. Could prove useful. I don't a pile of tape can prove anything, Detective. How will they gather in evidence? By sticking to it? Contaminated. I'm oddly surprised, okay. surprised that Dooley knows what contaminated evidence should even mean. I think he does, since he has talked about the... Uh, yeah, faking evidence a lot at. A box of theater props from fake food to skulls to actively crying masks at the clay children whose eyes follow you to a full-sized actual alive horse. Oh, and door handles, how handy. Huh? Huh? Handles, handy, see? I don't get it. I give up. Oh, I see. Give up, up because you can lift a handle up to open a door. What a clever detective. I think he's actually trolling him here. Okay. I think I can have a go. I didn't know you could play the drums. Where do you get where did you hear that? <laughs> it actually gives a little sound effect. If we took uh, If we took this We could save the world from just a tiny fraction of his singing. <laughs> Good great idea. I say we could start a pen, but sure. That we're taking it anyways. Ceremony curtains in the middle in the school's color, mold green. The ropes that would open the curtains if they weren't, as was mentioned, broken. Yeah, the prop doors. Some prop doors for actors to walk in and out of scenes through. They have hinges despite never having been attached to a frame. Some kid always had to swing them open and close and make creaking noises as they did so. Okay, now, there we go, back there. Thank Flock, that's over. Flock? Yeah, cutting out the cursed words. Oh, cause the baby? They accidentally turned our dog into a frog. She chews less stuff now, though, so I don't want to risk undoing it. <laughs> uh, probably for the best we stopped. Now that I'm getting on in years, I don't want not the... I don't uh, have the sand stat to sing too many of the songs that should not be sung. <laughs> My arms are killing me. I only play three songs. Dude, I'm 46 now. I only have the energy for three songs. I feel bad ruining the entertainment, but need, uh, but, uh, uh, but needs must. I also really think the lyrics were driving that man in the corner insane. Okay. <laughs> oh. Now we have when a way to get in. When you mention insane, the insane will come out. Hello, Rom. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> so, what happened, and where's El Dulio? Uh, El Dulio was... <laughs> El Dulio <laughs> probably went on rent and got retired after all that bullshit, but <laughs> this time we have to deal with the actual du uh, Dooley and his... Uh, well, he would say boyfriend probably, but Dooley do does not want. Dooley does not want. What the fuck did Dooley do this time? Actually, it was his own pants. doing this time. Uh, yeah, basically, while he was stuck in the dark side for that whole year, he basically got adopted by Buff Thulo over there. Only back then, uh, Buff Tulu was Tiny Tulu, like only not even coming up to his shoulder, I think. And uh, yeah, he's been working out since. <laughs> anyway, we need to stop him from just destroying the city. So let's get him to destroy his high school where there's a classroom instead. And it's not a great a solution. Uh, wait, really? Actually, oh, right. Uh, I should probably say, tell this to Rom. We actually kind of met him in the last episode. He was the tentacle lifting in the flashback. Yeah. And yeah, he's been in the fla other flashbacks as well, just off screen to the point where you only see like a tentacle or a wing. 
We should be able to get the door open with this. Here we go. All right, the control room. This is good. Yeah, real good. We should unlock the other door into this place. Of course, being able to get back in will help. Yeah. Of course, being able to get back in will help with what comes next. You What's sure could enact. <laughs> you sure could enact the plan from here. One hell of a plan. You'd use all this audiovisual stuff to do it. Oh, obviously, the last piece of it. Do you know how to use this stuff? I can't even name most of it. We might need to find some experts. Okay, scoreboards. Remember, remember when this broke so coach just glued a seal up for uh, for our score and we still end up with a higher result than normal? <laughs> what? Camera bank. <laughs> this is get yeah, this is what gets projected onto the big screen. Yeah, we need to do something with the big screen to <laughs> lure the big monster over. What have you? Okay, we can figure this out. We just need to find a few things. We need a microphone for out of the mount. For out on the mount. We need cables to run uh, from the mic back to the desk here. I once had to use the cable from the upstairs EV room to tie down a hog that got loose in the school. Why was there a loose hog in the school? Well, we were stealing a mascot. Uh, you, you know what? I can't recall. We're going to need a crew to operate the cameras on this desk. Where are we going to find a bunch of people who can work gear like this? Well... Bar... <laughs> Wait, did we say the same name at the same time? No, but I... We do have a class reunion going on with people who... <laughs> with people who've likely gotten into this stuff. Pretty much as the hot, hot spot label says, a place for connecting audio cables. Okay, also Dooley. Is this how Betty would have turned out if she went into media instead of science? Betty being the rogue AI he somehow keeps in his uh, Boy Scouts uh, lodge. Is it a to here? Oh. I spent a I spent a lot of my high school time back here. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Kissy, kissy, big man. What? No, this is the best nap spot on the campus. I mean, I prefer, I don't prefer the term small too big. <laughs> Actually, not surprised there. Okay, so we're into the, A the AV room that was being blocked off earlier. Now, Marv, you're a media kind of guy. I need some help. Need me to man a camera while you project an image of your friend here onto the big screen to lure a giant monster away from the sea? How did you know? Now you know. You've got the look. The look. <coughs> the luring a monster away from the city look. It's in the eyes. I'll meet you out on, on the field. Now, who else was in AV Club? Animator, maybe? Uh, that's a lot of TVs. Uh, pineapple? <laughs> Oh, AV stands for audio visual. That makes way more sense. Yes. What, what did you think it stood for? Airborne virus. Why? <laughs> Why would there be a room for that? I don't know, but I, I don't know, but I was hardly gonna go into investigate. Only one of us does stuff like this, and it and it ain't this guy. How did you pass the police exam? It's you, it's you is what I'm saying. And I think no? through sheer fucking brute force. Yes. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I don't want to yeah. even, I'll give it up. I don't know how we got into the police force. <laughs> a plastic tray, about the size of a box of cereal. I was not listening. But what did you say about a box of cereals? 
and enlarger used to check film negatives. And enlarge on images? Like, can it turn this dollar bill into a hundred dollar William? What? Really? I don't think that's what it's supposed to be called. Mm. Uh, Billy, we're not committing fraud while saving the world. <laughs> that uh, <clears throat> different uh, denominations of the dollar have different uh, people on them. So, uh, yeah, presuming the one hundred dollar bill has either has someone with the first or last name William. I'm not familiar enough with the presidents to guess who. Also, hello, Knight. How are you doing today? I'm doing hello, pretty Knight. good myself. Still on the end uh, of uh, the flu with the coughing and sneezing, but overall well. I wonder what decade it turned. I wonder what decade it turned into. Now that that works. I love this thing. It was the perfect bit of spy gear. You know, it was tapes like this that took Nixon down. Yeah, took the Watergate tape. Took him down to where? I don't remember. I don't remember Nixon going here. But then again, I don't. Uh, then again, I don't not remember it. So mathematically, he mustn't have. It's 9 p.m. The perfect time to rock out with your clock out. It's phrasing, duly phrasing. What? <laughs> Actually, no. Pain. Don't answer. Don't answer. Don't answer. <laughs> We're moving L from that line. No, I said don't. <laughs> I said like, don't answer. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone go back to me? Yeah, I'm back from getting called away. So. No problem. Oh, that's what happened. <clears throat> Various cables for camcorders, microphones, and even some scarred, you know, cutting edge stuff. Scarred? What the heck is that supposed to mean? Do you think the re Do you think the readers will remember our cable? Hell, even camcorders are out of reach. One of these should come in handy. Uh, what's with all of these? Why would anyone need so many old TV screens? Don't think, just buy. What kind of a slogan is that? I agree, but also, where is the nearest retailer? <laughs> uh, let's see, night. Go ahead. I was say, you'd be surprised how many people are willing to buy functional old TVs. Yeah. Uh, let's see, Knights doing very good. Dropped one K on something for my uh, VF. So excited uh, for that to be done. Okay. It's more Vern and no way. McKing was in the AV club. Who? McKing, our mortal him. enemy. No, McKing. <laughs> oh, duly he doesn't have enemies. Whoever this McKing fella is, that's your beef. A part of me gets the feeling that Dooley might be getting on early onset dementia or something, but then I, I remember, oh yeah, it's just Dooley. Dooley, again, after meeting El Dulio and then finding out, I wanted to show you this wrestler who looks like me, and rather than it being El Dulio, it's the big buff female wrestler that was guarding the backstage. I kind of feel like Dooley's like Kurt Redneck. Uh, uh, like, he's probably so red in the neck, his neck gives off a flash, signs like a light. I, actually, no, he's he, he's of Scottish descent. Uh, the Irish. Yeah, Irish. The Irish lip. Probably pissed off like one person in my audience there. <clears throat> Dick Brickman here reporting the news of the day, and that news is that the alumni of Teal High have come together to really. Uh, Okay, I thought maybe we could ask him to uh, help with everything, but looks like we need someone else. Uh, mm -hmm. Oops. Any of you? Hmm. Are we going to need someone else for this? I get the feeling it is going. We are do need someone else as well. Burn. Mm -hmm. And if you knew you were in the AV club with McKing, don't remind me. Pretty sure he thought AV meant all viable options. Gross. 
Okay, so uh, the uh, city is under attack from a giant monster thing. Oh, man, this is why I came back from Tokyo. Work from home, <laughs> work from home defense bunker days were getting all too common. <laughs> It's okay, not the response I was expecting. Look, I need help luring it away from the city. The word luring there suggests you're bringing it nearer to here, where we are, where I am, where I keep my organs. That is center of the plan. You in? Sure, this reunion blows anyway. <laughs> cool, meet me at the sports field. See you there. And also gets his access here. I gotta ask <sighs> McCain for his help. Oh dear. Is this guy? Uh, hang on, let me check a thing. Or five. Okay. Is this guy still at large? I think the zombie army trilogy that comes like the four pack might actually be fucking what, fifteen or ten dollars? I think I saw it at twelve. I put it in the my I bleh. After you suggested, I put it in the shopping bag. Or shopping, yeah, cart. But shopping I haven't. Cart. Uh, I could buy a, a four pack of those. Yeah, for the record, don't give me one. Um, I already have it. Okay. It's it's filled with the paintings that didn't make it onto the wall. It's just a bit of. It, it's just. It's just a pin in disguise. Buy buckshot roulette. Okay. Because the multiplayer beta is out right now. Paper? Yes. So let me Your check how much is Buckshot Roulette. Let me see something. I've seen a bit of the multiplayer so far and blow the heck the chaos. Okay. I mean, you've all. I mean, I. I mean, you saw me play it. What did you expect? And that with four players, that's going to be absolute mayhem. It's six dollars and six, six. No, it's six solas and thirty-seven cents. Okay. So let's, let's take a look at how much <laughs> that would be in dollars. It's titled "Colors in a Bowl." Eighty-four dollars. What the know. fuck? Oh wait, yeah. no, it's in Russian for some reason. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's fucking stupid. Yeah, the the Russian. Coinage is uh, pretty sure I'm that's in the crapper for the long go. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, you know what? On the okay. um, I'm leaving a link on general gaming. Just uh, just see what it is at a price that isn't in Russian. Yeah, okay. Also, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the joke here. <laughs> what are those round things on the skull? The, the eyes? Yeah, oh, notice yeah, something. <laughs> oh dear. Whatever pose they were trying to paint, they blew it. Look at those cheekbones, cat skeletons, bee models. I'm not sure what this is meant to be. That's how you know it's good art. One good unit of art. <laughs> Man running from man in pants. Mannequin. Looking good, mannequin. Wait, good mannequin? Oh, bloody heck. Looking good, mannequin. Oh, <laughs> bloody heck. A lot of black markers with different colors pla painted on the ends and the slogan Colors in the Imagination printed along the side. <laughs> a small tub, jar, receptacle of white correction fluid with a tiny white brush. It'll come in handy to clean up any, any errors the writer leaves in. Season 1 sure had a lot of those. <laughs> Do these brushes look like the old art teachers? Smart, smart money shaving scheme. A tube of red paint. You never know when you need you know, to mark off a plague doctor. Or pl a, a plague door. <laughs> For a second, I thought, why would you want to paint a, pa a plague doctor? Also, I'm pretty sure the SCP one from that would not be happy with that. Oh dear. But now I kind of want to see them get pranked. Like, they, they just put up a, uh, a bucket of red paint in the door, and then the plague doctor just comes through. Gonna make him. 
<laughs> gonna make him extra angry, but still. Okay. Good God, this is getting stupid. Actually, hang on a second. Let me see something. There's Vern. There's Marv. And here's McKay. <clears throat> Look, McKing, you're the last person I want to come to for help. Then you must not like getting good help. You're an idiot, is what I'm saying. Good one. Now, the city's in trouble. A gigantic thing is smashing the place, and I need help to get it here. Your help. A gigantic thing? Maybe you should be the one under the bleachers smoking whatever fucking herb you could find in the kitchen before you left home this evening. Okay, I'm pretty bored. What kind of help? I need your AV skills. I'm listening. I need you to control the stadium cameras and, and yeah, the stadium cameras and audio. We're putting on a show. <sighs> I may not like you, McQueen, but I swore an oath. The service oath? I know I swore it too. What? Not that junk. What kind of cops cares about that? I swore an oath to never leave any cable unplugged, any event unrecorded, and any request for help setting up the VCR unanswered. <laughs> I'll see you dorks in the control room. The service oath. <laughs> Good one. Yeah. That's all of them. I can head to the control room now. We're right there anyways. I even wonder how did even King get into the police force? Brian Rick probably. His, he is... <laughs> isn't his... Isn't his wife the former mayor or something? Who was the mayor oh, in the previous <laughs> game? A question, a good question if she's still current mayor or not. Hmm. This brings me back. How did you go from being an AV kid to being a detective? I wanted to uh, play a cop on TV, but I figured this was less work. <laughs> really? Okay. I should get the mic in place before connecting him. <coughs> okay. Uh, let's put that over here then. Let's get the setup here. Okay. Then the cable. Let's run this back to the control room. Okay. Let's actually have a chat with you two. Great. Good to go? I'm good to go home, if that's what you mean. <laughs> you ready up there? No kidding, I've been practicing for this day since we, uh, we were actually in high school. This, yeah, this actual game, a <laughs> day. A monster and all. That is very odd. Okay. Pretty sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, anything else we need to do? Hmm. Let's see. If everything, let's do this. How'd you go, Dooley? Okay. okay. <clears throat> oh man, if I don't come back from this, tell my wife I love her. What? Julie, you're not married. She'll know what it means. Who? Okay. Who'll know what it means, Julie? Uh. Oh dear. It's me. Come over and say hi, terrible fiendish friend. Wow. Hmm. It doesn't seem to be working. I don't think the creature can hear us. He couldn't hear it. We need to boost the volume somehow. Boost it? It's already at maximum levels. But what if it wasn't? But it is. Yes, but what if it wasn't? You're making no sense. It's Dooley. Right now, this is uh, right now. This is a ten. If we can find a way to make it go uh, go to eleven, it'd be louder. And how do we make it uh, do that? We just write eleven next to the ten. Jeez, this guy doesn't get it, does he? The more you say, the less sense it makes. But unless you have a better plan. Right. So we're really? that out of ideas that we. We need the pen. Do we actually need the correction fluids? I'll just mark a little eleven on here. Now crank it up, McKing. This is so stupid. 
Really? Ready. Is this actually going to... Okay, Dooley, hit it. And try to avoid any copyright infringements. <laughs> I'm doing my best. I'm on the highway <laughs> to hell. Wrong. It's a copyright no. hell. Oh, <laughs> 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 rum. What the heck? Is he actually going to sing? The page <laughs> hits me. I guess you won't be in your life. Isn't Looks this like you your don't sign? Back. I will let him do it. <laughs> when I say I've grown, I don't mean that in a physical sense. I mean I'm more mature. Or something. I'm not so good with words. <laughs> so I'll say, please stop destroying that city. All my favorite stuff is there. It's one thing to think that you're scary. I'm not paid to be scared. Uh, do you think your powers of darkness can defeat the power of rock? It's fine that I put your powers behind me. Turn back the time, turn back the clock. And there's the copyright infringement. <laughs> Officer Patrick Dooley turned back the clock, stuck at the Vision TOPD records. <laughs> I want to see if someone actually did a somewhat professional version of that. It's working. The monster is on its way. Oh, no. Now what? Uh, I guess we go to the roof. Well, the monster is on its way. I thought it was big before, but now that it's approaching, I'm starting to get a real handle on the scale of this problem. It's way bigger than he was uh, was a year ago. All oh, my trade has really helped. But you, the trading was your idea. I I thought yeah. he was puffing up because he was getting jealous, uh, more and more jealous of Dooley wanting to get out of his reach. No, no, he, he mentioned that. Uh, Come on, let's go to him. You that you told me how to train. So yeah, it's Dooley's fault. Because I can see that in the current situation is nothing to be proud of. But I still am! You... So you... Ah, but I still am! You did be... You be... Uh, let me drink something. <laughs> there you go. But I still am! You did be... Let me... Lord's sake! I still am. You did be so swole now if you listen to me, detective. There we go. Yeah, if only we were facing him before he bigged up. Hmm. Is there a way to rewind time? And undo all my hard work? Yes. Uh, fine, let's go ask around and see if anyone here is a so called time expert. Oh. Uh, I think we know who. Let's see, if we want to find a way to reverse this year of training... And that is a big if! We need to find some uh, kind of time expert to revise, okay. Well, we know a certain professor who quite literally has Loop in her name. And is seen in multiple decades of class photos the same age. So you don't look any older than you did back when we were in school. How's the lounge you know, style and all that? Lots of fiber and prunes. Are you sure you don't have some kind of time machine you're not telling me about? Time machine? Ludicrous! Yes, I have a time chain where I invented and went to brag about and stay quiet all these years has driven me mad. I need to use it. What? No, I want to brag, not share. Please, there is a giant monster coming to crush us and we need a, a way to de-age it so we can defeat it. What rubbish, you won't trick me into sharing my machine with such audacious <laughs> lies. What if I could prove it to you? Sure. You prove there's a threat, then we'll talk. Okay, and how the heck are we going to do that then? Paint the make damn her, thing? Make her look Ooh, outside the door? Or the window? Um, Brickman bricked his pants and left, it seems. Wait, do we need to bring down the TV? Stepping over buildings now, rather than on them. That's something. Somehow I get the feeling we're going to be blamed for all of this. 
even though we're the ones solving it. So I am back because I missed a bunch of stuff because someone turned on the microwave. <laughs> okay. Hmm. How the heck are we supposed to get her to walk and look out a freaking window? Well, what you missed, uh, Derby, is we trying to convince uh, Miss Time Expert that there's a monster outside. Hmm. It's, what the heck are we even going to need to use the milk for? Or do I even want to ask? I don't think we want to ask. Okay, I'm looking up a hint for this. De developing a film is one of the... Okay. After you signal the monster... Mm -hmm. yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. What to do? Show her proof, yes. Ah. There's a note saying gone to develop some pictures back in a few. Please don't borrow the camera for a harebrained scheme to prove something to somebody. <laughs> Yoink! Yoink! Okay. There. Say cheese. Cheese, I mean, roar. <laughs> I'm surprised you can hear that. That was easy. Do we show her Oh, I guess we need to get the pictures out. Also, yeah. why do we need to let Derby read the text? <laughs> uh, she can do the next on ones. Uh, well, we have on who you want the read. text, so now we... Or pictures, so now we need to try and develop these. No chemicals in there to develop the photos. The room is too bright. The you know, pictures would be you know, destroyed. We need some red lights. I don't really know why. I'm basing all this off TV and films. But we need it, goddammit. Okay. Roxanne, <laughs> you don't have to paint on that red light. Oh god, that song. <laughs> but we do. Uh, uh, god, that song is awful. I don't know who that song is by, but I freaking hate that song. But that Roxanne, fuck. Is the I think pretty sure the artist is called Roxanne. <laughs> Roxanne. No, no, no. Uh, I think it was the police. Hmm. Maybe. <laughs> that would make any that makes it even more of a joke since they are the police. That's cool. uh. They won't stay up. I need a way to stick them in place. Okay, so that's what we do there. This reminds me of my student days. Dude, you still have refuge sacks tapped over your windows. Take that with you. Yeah, but then it was because I was poor. Now, now I do it because I have UC secrets. Of course, what? blackout blinds. Some homemade blackout blinds. I wonder of uh, I wonder of arts and crafts. A wonder of. Uh, <laughs> this should darken uh, the place for us. It's getting very romantic in here. Okay, now just chuck these in there. This stuff, uh, yeah, this stuff should let us develop, develop some photos. That or make slime. Time to develop some pictures. An uncomfortably long amount of time later. Look, the pictures have dried and the uh, yeah, images are coming through. Okay. I have no more use for these dangerous chemicals. Okay, so we just... Oh, wait. Uh, wrong. There. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, this one should do. Develop picture. Here. Mm. How about you, Wing? 
These are some good shots for your birthday. I'm getting you a camera. You need a help you outside of monster of the weakling. Weaking. Weaking? What? But not just any old camera. I see how you use things once and then throw them away. I can give you a disposable camera with the 11 of its 12 shots taken, the perfect gift. <laughs> he does have a point with that. And that, but it also feels like a damn insult. <laughs> okay. This should prove to Time Loop that there's a danger of it. Hopefully, then she'll let us use her time machine to rewind the monster by one year to when it was smaller. Phew, that wasn't one hell of a sentence. MS Word would have underlined the hell out of that. <laughs> See, photographic proof that, uh, that the giant monster is on its way here to very literally stomp us all out. Not mate. What? Do you... do you mean checkmate, maybe? Uh, I was... Uh, I was the president of the chess club when I... when it was shut down, so I think it's... I, I didn't know. I think I can guess Wait, why it mm. shut down. <laughs> so, you're gonna grab... Oh, yes, yeah, so you're gonna hold up your end of the bargain and show me your time machine? You always were a pain, McQueen. Fine. Come with me to the... science lab! How was it? Mm -hmm. I was gonna I was gonna joke that these two fucked in high school. So what'd you bring yeah, me in here? Yeah, what what did you bring me in here to see? Behold my time machine. You haven't revealed anything. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Behold <laughs> my time machine. <laughs> Ooh. Yes, that is the reaction I wanted. Impressed? Oh, sort of? Out. I mean, it doesn't look like much, but yeah, it's neat. Why did you bring him? Well, I'll be a UFO. A UFO? What? Yeah, like, like a spaceship. Dr. Timelip here is an alien. It's Professor, I'm not an alien. This isn't a UFO, it's a sort of a time machine. A few doors in your specifics. Let's get to the meat of things. Do we cut the doctor's brain out or not? No. Again, it's Professor, and please don't. So, a time machine. Not quite. I can't go back in time or anything. It uses more of a stasis organic manipulation energy. I can slow my uh, aging. Can you do other things, speed it up or reverse it? It's theoretically possible, but it's a chamber, not a weapon. Only a few things to convert it. A gun barrel to focus the energy through, a laser to guide the shot, and a switch to act as a trigger. Is that your find the stuff for me? Gun barrel, laser, switch. We're on it. Yeah, you might need full access to the school. Take these keys. What? No, it's dangerous to go alone. Take these. But you're not alone. Your friend here is with you. I'd have to say it's dangerous to travel in groups of less than three. <laughs> not so punchy. Yes, all that joke. Okay. Oh boy. A bunch of keys to the school. I say a bunch, I mean four. Well, that means we can get into the principal's office now. Yoink. Okay, Dooley, let's check this place out. I feel like I'm in trouble somehow. I was half expecting, like, a... some occult thing on the wall. Um, there is a occult thing on the wall. Now, unless it starts talking, it's not. Notes and such for the principal. Expel the following students, all of them. To do, round up all copies of office keys from staff. Can't have a pesky detective coming in, finding all my secrets. And a brown envelope of money with please pass my uh, son written on it. You should confiscate that last one. No. Very real certificate of education and stuff. Get a green whatever I need <laughs> to get this job. If anything, I did say he's overqualified. A hunting trophy. We should take it. We should take it and set it free. We should. <laughs> <laughs> I hope expected to talk. Yeah. 
A state-of-the-art dot, state dot matrix printer. The school really is on the cutting edge of technology. In like, what, the 60s? <laughs> Awful chair. This, this chair is made of spiders. And not the good kind either. Okay. Fancy chair. The tag says it's filled with baby fat. Which is the fat you lose as a kid before your adult fat comes in. That's <laughs> my brain. And also, I think I know what this spider shade is a reference to. No. Undertale. That's a Could actually be, yeah. Who made everything out of spider. Four spiders, from spiders, and. Uh, here's the weird thing. Oh, it's my turn again. <clears throat> <clears throat> Me, 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 me. It's amazing that this device can connect us to any of the tens of phones across the city. It didn't really catch on here as a technology, did it? I plant a Venus child trap? What? It's like a <laughs> recipes for cooking books. Or cooking books or cookbooks? Probably cooking books. Cooking the books. Uh. <laughs> Broad. Lots of student info dating back to our time here. There's nothing I want from all this. You sure? Don't want to dig up some previous lost dirt on, say, McKean? Dooley, I've told you before, we can't abuse your power like that. We have a well. You already checked it. You're, you already checked it, didn't you? Oh, absolutely. First thing I looked for. <laughs> okay, what's this computer? There's no info on here, it just seems to be used for writing a material for the printer. Okay. Hmm. A deer skull with uh, sigils engraved on it. Oh, great. I was right. Yes. Hmm. Y you were wrong about it starting talking. I was right, it actually was an occult item. Let's see. What the heck? We need a switch, a barrel, uh, no, no, and a no, laser. No, 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 I'm not letting you borrow my Nintendo Switch. No. Let's see. <clears throat> I'm not sure what other places there are that we can go look. And I half was expecting it to be this thing, the time machine. <clears throat> I always think you to go on the water with that. Okay, yeah, let's check this place out. Again. <clears throat> my fun man should use this. My fun man should use algebra in their investment algorithm. And now I have an assortment of squared letters and very little cash. <laughs> Go, Jay. <laughs> Palette of currently discovered colors. Some scientists claim there may be more. These scientists have been locked away. Rightly so. That's my old desk. You can tell that. That's my old desk. You can tell from all the gum I stuck under it. It's literally <laughs> sagging under the weight. It's pretty solidly caked on there. It should be. It, it should be a wonder or. Oh, bloody. It should be a wonder of the world, the uh, hanging garden of bubblegum. Okay, people, I need to say, I thought that was a piece of cloth, cloth, not gum. <laughs> a laser pointer? Use it to point at little, use to point at laser. So close, buddy, so close. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Yes, no, oh, that's one bit. I need to face palm hard for this one. Yes, I'm actually face palming. Uh, the four humors and how to balance them. A cardboard box painted dark brown. <laughs> wait, wait, did you say humors or humans? Humors. Alright, so, I want to say. The, 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 actually, yeah, there's only two humans here. Then that's me and 
and uh, dirty. That's very green. <laughs> now, and now I'm trying to think of the what four kinds of uh, jokes they've got in this game. They've got the silly, they've got the rhetorical, they've got dark, and what would the third one be? Ironic? Ironic, they don't have those that doesn't classify to either, that they're just... You can't help just to wonder what the heck did you just read? Fancy trip down memory lane, Dooley? That does sound nice, Detective, but we should really stay here until that creature is taken care of. Okay, what have we here? A perfect replication of the Earth, even down to the plastic face and giant metal arm that holds it in play. <laughs> Various school books, nice and neatly organized. Floor plan of you know, this place might prove useful. No. This chair looks comfy, sure, but when you get close, you see it's made of concrete. Let's see, there's a skull etched into it and the words, Take me now, Mr. F. Phrasing. These things were so uncomfortable. Why did they have little tacks all over them? I hate to tell you this, but the king glued those to your desk. I am not surprised. That guy. The writing <laughs> says red marker. Hmm. This map has both too many and not enough continents. I can't really say what's wrong with it, other than the fact that. It puts America in the middle, which just cuts Eurasia and Europe. Yeah, Eurasia in middle to get the split. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, somebody fucked up the world map. Yeah. Do I have heard that they teach continents different in some countries? Hmm. Like, in Russia, I think they teach the, that there is no Europe or Asia, just Eurasia. Okay, uh, hell. I got bored and asked Liz, and she said sure to a copy of Zombie Army Trilogy. Okay. Hmm. Well, that uh, was something else. Uh, I think Hex also has Zombie Army Trilogy. Yeah, Hex has it. Uh -oh. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> well, that was something. Zakir, would you be willing to shoot the undead no. Nazis? No. Why not? I'm <laughs> bad FPS. The only FPS I've been allowed to do that has been Deep Rock. It's not a third person shooter, it's a first person. It's not a first person shooter, it's a third person shooter. Hello. <laughs> well, then we gotta find a fourth person. Because I. Well, actually, we had to have to find two more people because I have a copy. Alien probably gets himself a copy. Liz would probably get a copy. Now we're missing two more people. They get a full squad. Did Hex have one? Yeah, Hex has one. But he's been proven to be a bit uh, difficult to get uh, available. Yeah. Mm. Also, there's one person you could ask behind you. Gervin Lord, you want a copy? Of which now? Uh, Zombie Army Trilogy. I think I might be good on that. You have it? <laughs> no, I don't have it. I'm just like, eh. Oh, okay. Not sure. Was, oh. Feel free to ask around on gate, uh, Ram. For people who want to join. Yeah. Yeah. Another well, people just say this: we are still not holding Rome hostage. As much as may look. I'm sure you're just gonna look it up a little bit real quick here. Uh, <clears throat> well, that was something. He felt transported. Sadly, I was not. I'm still here in the pause of an angry and rapidly approaching creature. Okay. Um. Nothing else here. Yep. Even I'm surprised that 11 worked. Stranger things have happened. Yeah, that, that, that was that, that was just plain and simple an asshole. Uh, let's see where. Uh, no. Wait, did he? Or. Hmm. Wait, what were we looking for again? We need a gun barrel of sorts, 
if a laser and a switch. What? Why do we actually need? Well, we Four have a panels of school grounds. Yeah. Uh, so let's see if we can turn that in. Wait. Do we have some place that keep uh, confiscated things? Possibly. Okay. Now we can aim this thing. We need a gun barrel to fire this thing at the time being through. We need some kind of trigger. Hmm. Is there any room we haven't mm -hmm. been to yet? Oh, so what's with that? There's a flyer for the Dangle. carnival here. I have a feeling that might be useful. A flyer Wait, for the carnival you? listing their shows and rides, dates in the area, and phone number. We should go there sometime. It looks fun. Dude, we were just there. We investigated all those missing people. I got teleported to a reality game. <laughs> it's sure run by insane clowns. There goes the Tesla was there. You fired his giant gun. Oh, giant gun. If I can f ring Vince, I could ask him to borrow that. There should be a phone in the principal's office. No, oh, I didn't think that would actually go anywhere. Okay. And he had probably to find a gun in a... Case box or something here because it doesn't have. Oh, for mm, I just have an attempt. Uh, whatever. <laughs> What's going on, Ram? Having trouble in the game? No, it's not a game. It's the. How do I explain this? She, my boss, is telling me uh, about us to do it. What the fuck? Okay, then. Hmm. Uh, uh, while you get your ducks in a row, I'll just continue for a bit. Lady Farnival's Frivolous Carnivals. Vince, it's Detective McQueen here. I need you to bring Tesla's ray gun to Twin Lakes High immediately. Please, business. Give me a second to face mask. Ask. Mumbling up the queen <laughs> and the throne phone. He says you can. Uh, he says you can be Cal Pitt, have it on one nuclear fission condition. He wants. Uh, he wants you to make sure any cap and coat hooks, school books, uh, there say that he fermented authentically invented electricity and not space medicine. Tommy Edison. Sure. Starship Trooper. Super. I'll put it on the uh, dock truck and get it to you. Clip it. <laughs> clippity clack. ASAP. What is it with that guy and just rhyming is what he means instead? Um, okay, so we need to we need to get to the school books and edit them apparently. Uh, where were those? No. Uh, let's see. No. There we go. Mm -hmm. These are the books we need to alter for Tesla. I guess we should go print out some updates. Okay, for that we need to go back to the principal's office again. Too well, facts. Uh, one too many. Okay, printer. Let's print out some labels to meet Tesla's demands. You should have been managed on making demands. They are threatening you with ray guns. Not giving you a ray gun. Don't give me ray guns. Blah. Okay, revised history printouts. Labels clarifying Edison's place in the electric history. <coughs> and stating he was a doo doo head. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> I don't believe you wanted you to do that. Eh, uh, just a bonus. There, the paper keeps falling out. You need to find a way to gummy them. Oh. Oh no. Mm hmm. Do we need. Uh. The paper? Hmm. No. Hmm. <clears throat> uh, that makes sense. 
I mean, I must be missing something then. It's, it's almost fine. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe something in the art class that is with some glue? I said art class. It's a lot fancier than anything else around here. Don't touch it! That. No children. What the? Mr. Cinnabite had that installed to keep us from messing with his nice hair, remember? Yes, apparently uh, people a Cinnabite work at the school. It's... Hmm. I wonder if they got... I wonder if they need models for life drawings. Or get me some of that sweet Academia greens. Okay, I think we'll actually need to look up a hint for this one, so give me a sec. Alright. <clears throat> I don't think you can meet actual monsters soon. Let's add gum. Mm hmm. This one. There we go. I forgot about that one. And now the tools are free to be taken again, just as God intended it. <laughs> Screwdriver, chisel. That uh, uh, we're going to need a chisel. A man, a chisel, 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 chisel. Did we? Did we do a chiseled abs joke in season one? <laughs> yeah. Bugger. Uh, now, now I'm reminded of one scene from uh, Dragon Ball Z Abridged with Frieza just getting a close-up of Goku's abs, just going, Oh, you could, you could grind meat with those or something like that. <laughs> I haven't tried re-watching those, but I was never a, really a big Dragon Ball Z fan when I was younger. Yeah, Dragon Ball Z Abridged is way better anyways. I... I read a little Dragon Ball that came with uh, included in something. Yeah. But like, I think, yeah, I never got into it. Yeah. I think the younger me just felt it was a little too over the top. I still think it's way too over the top, even as a kid and an adult. Now I want to see that no one to see if we can get up a Dragon Ball Z a bridge to marathon going or something. No, no, I can't <laughs> handle that bridge stuff. I can't handle that bridge stuff. They it's just too much for me. Wait, wait, wait. I don't think I can handle it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, weak. Let's chip it's... some of this off. Yes. <laughs> no. Oh, how could you? Oh, there you go, yeah. Might stop done. the cold in my <laughs> Yes. <laughs> they actually put a new animation bit for that. And we won't work to get my two solids. Need to heat it up. I could reshoot it. <laughs> oh, he even did that as well. Blech. Also, for the captain, uh, and the great A solution. Hmm, where the hell would you even go to heat something up here? We haven't seen a kitchen or anything. But yeah. Hmm. All right. Science lab? Oh. Oh, wait, we do have a kitchen here. Yeah. Oh, I can't no. believe we're about to heat your old chewing gum. Do you think it could come to life? 
I didn't think it was ready to be. Uh, wait, no, I read that wrong. Do you think it could come to life? I didn't think it was ready to be a dog, but microwave your own ma mastication paste really seems a guy, you know? What is that word? Mastication. Like oh. mastodon and such, chew. Okay. I'm so proud. I'm so proud of my. Ugh. I'm so proud of my mouth babies are all grown up and working in academic no less. Oh, Gross oh, labels. Really? Okay, moving on from that. <laughs> yeah, let's get the facing. You're slug in high school. Don't we didn't deface books in high school. You're right. We didn't. Duly. <laughs> okay, back to the principal's office so we can get our ray gun. We still uh, need a trigger. The ray gun is was downstairs. Yes. If we want Tesla's gun barrel, we need to doctor. Yeah. <laughs> he, he, you walked past the ray uh, gun. It was downstairs. He was downstairs waiting for you. See? I spotted him. <laughs> there you broke the car. All right, I, I yeah, brought that non Carol gun barrel for you. I hope you've erased your looks to face those books. It's sticky bun done. Are you making fun of me? What? No, I. Wait, you, did you not rhyme that last sentence? No, this is serious business. I'm out here bearing my soul, my art, and you're making fun of me. No, that's not that's not happening at all. I thought it was, you know, a nice gesture. I'm sorry, my bad. <laughs> you're an English more, sure. Yeah, of course. I wouldn't you know, do anything to purposely hurt you. Smiles and pixel. So. <laughs> yeah, give me that damn thing. Perfect, just what we need. Snip the yelp, happy to help. Stick that thing in our pants. Comically large. <laughs> okay. Comically large barrel. The obscenely large barrel from Tesla's anti chicken ray gun. Okay, why, okay. why chickens though? He really wanted revenge on a robot chick who was giving away his favorite pigeon. Okay, this should be the shoot the time. <laughs> Fucking work. We need some kind of trigger. <clears throat> oh okay, god, have... this this looks like something I would expect you and Rom and Groovy to build. <laughs> Not what I meant. Hmm. <laughs> okay, now. Let's see... A lever? Okay... Oh, right, yeah. There. Control lever for the sprinkler system. It has three settings. Off, focus, and spray. Uh, yeah. It won't budge. Um... Maybe we can use it as a trigger for the time gun? It won't budge, I need some sort of tool to loosen it. Okay, so back to the workshop then. Wrench. It's hard wrenching when you see normal everyday items being used in an adventure game, isn't it? <laughs> Absolutely wrench it design. May as well bring another screwdriver? This room is killing me with all these repeated items. Okay. What if these days I want to see just a joke where you need a screwdriver, but you just cannot find one anywhere, so you go to a bar to get the cocktail screwdriver and use that instead? Yep, then that's not the screwdriver. This should loosen the lever so we can take it. The soap does not a fire. <laughs> oh. Also, I think you think about... Corkscrews. 
Uh, I think screwdriver is an actual cocktail. I don't know what oh, it's you made actually. Like oh, you made like. Oh, you made like. Yeah, like. You made a drink. Yeah. Hmm. A trigger for our time gun. I think we're ready to fire. Lasers right on him, Detective. Ready when you are. So, time loop. This time machine and never getting old. It looks good on you. Okay, on three. Three. Now, really isn't the time, Kingsley. Two. Maybe we can get a coffee or something. Catch up. No, but King, don't lean on the trigger. <laughs> Oh, freaking course. It... Is everyone okay? <laughs> what? What happened? Their stupid gun. It made us all young again. You're the one who flipped the switch from focus to spray. <laughs> Why did you get a switch with a spray option in the first place? <laughs> Children, please. You've been in the age. That will apply to your homos as hormones as well. You're teenagers in every possible sense. He started it. We were only meant to reverse time by a year. What happened? I think that when your friend slipped, he grabbed the time dial to steady himself, thereby doubly screwing us all. I couldn't risk falling and looking not cool. I think we can agree that it was a worthwhile sacrifice and that this is still, all still somehow solely McQueen's fault. Great. Okay, we're gonna fix this. okay so what does Young Dooley look like? Like oh, Luigi. Oh, oh my king. I'm, okay. I'm less impressed with it now. No, 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 I can't. I will not do that voice. I will not do that voice again. And yeah, we can still poke McQueen. Where, where's my moustache? We better fix this, McQueen, and fast. Not going through puberty a second time. Say that word again. Puberty. No, no. Mustache. Mustache. It's must. Oh, fuck it. Uh, it's moustache. <laughs> yeah, but everybody says mustache. Oh, what? Is it a typo or. No, Maybe no, it's, it's not a typo. A lot of people. Some people say moustache, and some people say mustache. I say mustache. It's mustache. Oh, right. People do that. And there's also uh, a whole Dragon Ball Z Bridge team <laughs> joke about it. The song, so, and song, the joke song about it being moustache. Oh, dear. Right, let's see. You know, I owe my labyrinthian approach to crime solving to this place. The career guiding consular told me that I. Shouldn't be a maze if I ever found work. <laughs> I found <laughs> me. It, he, he would be amazed if he ever found work. Uh, Are you sure she didn't see be amazed? They have to. I'm not sure of anything. Uh, just like yeah. me. Give them back. For the one billionth time, I don't have them. I never had them. Then where did all my models go, huh? Hmm, it looks like these folk were relieving some childhood problem. I hope that's not the case around the school. We've already had one case of the elderly having a midlife crisis. We do not see teenagers having a midlife crisis. You fucking help nothing. Nothing! Something with work still bothering? Let's see. <laughs> little Brickman. Exclusive scoop from the school uh, for the school paper. I came back from the loot to find my camera had been stolen and everyone was young again. I need to cut back on my chrono fiber if I'm going to excrete out a few years with each movement. How <laughs> uh, will I make uh, good investments with this childish palette? Oh no, I couldn't swim at this age. How will I get home? Gabby. Oh wow! If we if we've gone back in time, yeah. we can get to Kingsley before his wife does. <laughs> oh no, I'm too young to work in my shop now. 
Mungan! Please don't make me uh, do it. Uh, please don't make me do this all over again. I was so close. <laughs> oh good, everybody got de aged. Uh, and now that the Why camera does he have a knife? The... Okay, actually, who wants to voice act him? Fuck it, I'll do it. <laughs> Now that the candidates have presented themselves, you may use your pencils and pads to vote for your Maytime Witch! Which, for some reason, your class never voted on. If the gods have seen to fix that by making us young again, those pranksters are probably just hungry for blood. So cast your votes and then pop them into the sacred ballot box! Sir? Sir? Yes, what is it? Sir, there is no ballot box. Ah, uh, now I remember. This year was the last year we ran this. Your year was the last year we ran this, and we couldn't complete it because the box was missing. Rat. <laughs> Who are you gonna vote for? I don't know. Uh, which one has the best thing <laughs> is that seems like good sacrifice to me? Candidate number two, so. He could, he could push a cantaloupe out with those haunches. <laughs> Canada the one is an old enemy of mine, so I want them to lose. But also I want them on the Maytime Pyre. Decisions, decisions. <laughs> I've worked so hard to get here. Do you know how many universes I had to deflower to be one of the final three Maytime candidates? Phrasing! Okay. <laughs> this is also exciting. You are not worried about being sacrificed? Of course not. These things are decided in smoky back rooms. I have no hope. It's just, but just, ha if, just to be here. It's liberating. You just don't stand a chance. I'm from a short line of sacrificial students. Wait, what? <clears throat> oh. Where's all the training here? What kind of, uh, you miss this? Where's the knee stretcher with an earlobe weight? What? There's not even an Iron Maiden, for goodness sake. <laughs> I think you're confusing Jim with Dungeon, Dooley. No, no, <laughs> not a dungeon. A torture chamber. Um, while we wait for me to remember where the box uh, was... Uh, 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 <laughs> my bad. Do not entice Rom's wrath. If even Rom is here at the moment, I'm here. Oh, welcome back. Thank okay. you. Your time to shine. One second. Um, but while we wait for me to remember where the box was, why don't our lovely contestants tell us about themselves? Nobody on stage while the voting takes place. Man, but I already did a thing to go back there. Don't care. Wasn't even in that scene back then. Okay, so we've got a, a deer trophy, a screwdriver, a fire map, and milk of all things. Hmm. Okay, so how do we fix this kerfuffle? Though, uh, hello, Vince. <laughs> Well, my little dipper, nipper, and hen again. Yeah, sorry about that. Now we're getting late, great. Uh, <clears throat> I can teeth dis discreetly, breathe so deeply. This time uh, I'm pulling a hoax, staying off the smokes. Oh, glad to have helped. <laughs> well, that's one. <laughs> one second. <laughs> All right. Yep. Uh. Where the heck did we get a bunch of cheerleaders from all of a sudden? <laughs> I'm not keen on this development. See, this lot of uh, this lot are having a healthy reaction to being young again, getting out and enjoying some excess. Behold, mortals! Mortals, we have <laughs> reformed in our new youthly vigor. Past lives of housewifery and office buildings and motherhood and law firms are behind us, forgotten like so many old routines. In our reformation, we shall recreate the masterpiece of our youth. Our magnum opus, the human pyramids. 
Soon the last piece shall be brought to us as we have been brought together. The apex is near. We can feel it. The horned god shall join us, climb us, and from, uh, from up on high reach for the very stars themselves. Uh, you lot want this? Uh, we want this to get on, though. Uh, Fern? Okay, we need someone to... Uh, oh. May he bleed for us all. <laughs> Without the robes, it's not. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's not the horned god. It's just a plain old ceremonial deer skull. <laughs> oh, may he bleed for us all. May he bleed for us all. May he bleed for us all. Okay, Marv. I don't know what's after, after happening, uh, but thankfully I had a smaller pair of headphones on hand. <laughs> oh, he hello there. There he is! Hey, Jeff! Hey, Patrick. Uh, him. You forgot already? Uh, Durvin. Yeah, if, if Durvin wants to, that is. Do you want to, Durvin, to voice act uh, Jeff? Sure. Alright. I'm just gonna say it. This is awkward. No, 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 man, it's... it's good. So, uh, we're all gonna go back. I wanna live here with Dooley. Yeah, alright. Dooley, aren't you forgetting something? I doubt it. I didn't remember it was, uh... I doubt it. I remember it was forgetting something. But I was forgetting something. Patricia and Buzz. Uh, they sound oh. awful. I'm kicking it's... them out as soon as we get home. <laughs> no, you're the one locking up. <laughs> Ugh, they sound awful. I'm kicking them out as soon as we get home. Wait, did I accidentally read that? Yes. Yeah, you, you read me. I didn't realize that. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, the stalking. Yeah. It's flattering. And the destruction this guy uh, causes across the uh, city. That's... That one's not my fault. I was just so mad. And strong from being big. I get pretty mad, you know? And apart from Dooley, I hate those. I hate humans. So you see, not my fault. But hey, we all have our issues. Is that right? I once saw Patrick here eat an entire box of haunted donuts. Also, can this guy stop with the slapping noises? It's like it sounds like he's whacking around two floppy dildos. <laughs> now on here that, I dare you. <laughs> I can't, but I didn't notice the sound until you pointed it out. I can't hear that shit. <laughs> Man, I had Man, I had diarrhea for days. Okay, let's go home, Dooley. I don't know, all that stuff is pretty bad, and I like living with my sister and nephew. Barf. This guy, he gets it. Hey, I like them too. I'm starting to remember why I left it in the first place. It'll be different this time, Patrick. <laughs> I promise. You're gonna be not. You're gonna be a nicer person. What? No, I just won't let you leave again. <laughs> nicer person? Not possible. Sorry, guy. When you're going home, you can't make me do nothing if you can't catch me. Hmm. <laughs> He's gone. If we want to catch him. We're going to need to build a trap. But we're going to Scooby Doo this bullshit. <laughs> Wait, wait, why he run when he's way bigger than us? Especially when we all, many most of us are either teenagers or kids. Because he's an idiot? Possibly. That board. We could use his panels to start building a cage for Jeff somewhere. But you cannot take the board. The board belongs to the act. We shall be incomplete without it. If we want those plates, I guess we'll, uh, we know what we need to do. 
Titan? No, Dooley. We'd never win that. No, we need to help them complete their whatever they're at. Okay, so we need to get our hands on some robes. Hello. Nevermore. Hey, the little fella. Car, car. Oh. <laughs> he seems a little distressed. Car. I actually uh, almost started voice acting him at the same time. <laughs> yep. Yo, milk. Here you go, wee fella. Tom. Love this milk, our Jeremy. Ahem. Yep. Yep. My bad. Well, we are both having a Bluetooth movement today. Yeah. Well, now, there you go. You're giving us something. Looks like a key. Jeremy Snow to. This, I get the feeling there is a uh, Game of Thrones reference in here. It is. It is. You're welcome, Jer. Okay, that, that was just a completely random... Let's see. The key to Jeremy Snow's locker. Wherever that is. Okay. It's a very random Game of Thrones reference. Uh, let's see. Is there anything around... Jeremy Snow in here somewhere. For fuck's sake. Most likely to be arrested for smashing pumpkins. That sounds like a joke. <laughs> a reference to yes, uh, a band. Yeah, smashing pumpkins is a is a band. Yeah, I get the feeling this might be one of its members. Uh, is that a unicorn? Uh, no, that's something. You already seen? Yeah. Transfer student. From where? I don't know. Hmm. I'm not actually seeing a Jeremy Snow around here. Have you tried? I accidentally skipped over them. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing one. Okay, so that was, that was just a complete and utter random stumble there. <clears throat> okay, uh, there were lockers up here, I believe. Okay. If we were to try every key on every lock, we'd get nowhere fast. <laughs> there's a puzzle here, isn't there? Of course there's a puzzle here. What's taking? All right. Yeah, we've seen that one. Uh, I mean, it's, it is. I'm surprised they actually dated. I thought he was only took him as a pet. Wait, who? Yeah. Uh, Buffalo. Yeah. 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 I, I think. <laughs> I think Jeff may have been uh, thinking of it both ways, like that, with Dooley just thinking, "Do not want. Do not want. Do not want." Let's see. Am I really just completely overlooking? Or is there a bird in here somewhere? Let's see. Well, there's Thompson, Candace, Sander, Yolanda, and Alex. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just not seeing a Jeremy here anywhere. Okay, I've another hint. Maybe he's not. <clears throat> Wait. Maybe he's put for a different year. As we cannot find him. It's the class of 1980, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. Costume. Yes. Two piece <laughs> robes. Ah, uh, right. Uh mm -hmm. Oh. 
Okay, apparently we needed to talk to the bunch up here. Uh, what's happening here then? When we were students here, she borrowed a load of my you know, Battle Hammer 42 Wargaming models, and I would want them back. I bet they're, they're worth tens of dollars now. Battle Hammer 42? Yeah, in the underlit future, there is only war over the meaning of life. It's a philosophical war game. <laughs> 42 constitutes a question of all things. Is there was a uh, Hitchman Geist Game Geist reference and a Warhammer 40k yoke? Yeah. Burrito. <clears throat> uh, do I have them? The models? Yeah, I didn't borrow his stupid models. Yeah, stupid models. No, I mean, I wouldn't use his dumb philosophers. They were underpowered. When I clashed philosophies, I clashed the win. Yeah, of course. Models are cool. What? And uh, so he's winning. We win all the time, right, detective? Uh, right. So if you can borrow them, who did? I I think it might have been my boyfriend at the time. Wait, weren't you dating? Yes. Uh, Jeremy Snow. Okay, so this is how we were supposed to know and learn about him. A boy who drank so much milk. No. Turned into a crow, wails passionately for a love lost to writer's block. <laughs> Sorry, what now? Didn't Jeremy Sh Snow just move schools? Oh, the theft, that that's just a lie that the big milk wanted you to believe. Uh, moving on, where would Jeremy have put them then? Don't say his nest, don't say his nest, don't say his nest, don't say his nest. In his nest? <laughs> Cries even more. Damn it, me! Let's uh, check his locker, maybe? Which one was his? Still crying. <laughs> I guess we could check the school records. Okay, wait, those are probably in the principal's office. So there, there. Let's see if we can find out where Jeremy Snow's locker was. Yeah, it was down by the chain, down in the changing rooms. Changing rooms? Like, just like how he changed into a crow? This investigation is bringing back some horrible memories, Detective. Why do I get the feeling he turned into a crow just because he... because somehow he drank you know, milk from a cursed cow or something? I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, that raised the question of where the heck the changing rooms are. Because there's a stage, there's backstage, there's Oh, the gym here. Actually, okay, no, no, the crows don't like take. They only extremely few birds like take. And I'm still not sure how that works. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. I'm be I, I forgot the one, the one room that has been useless so far. Okay, there, there, changing rooms. There's Jerry's locker. Right next to mine, I will remember. We need to find the key. No, oh, here's the key. Okay, Jeremy's locker. Let's see what's inside. Box of stuff. A box of junk, including war game miniatures. And every single Warhammer 40k and other tabletop wargaming band <laughs> it's ever ceases and now <laughs> best is all hell. <laughs> okay, here's your junk. Are these what you were looking for? Aristotle, Immolate Kant, and Voltaire, John Headlock, Confucius. <laughs> None of these were a match for my Viking space communist Jarl Marx. <laughs> Box isn't mine, though. Who wants a storage box with a hole in the lid? All this talk of philosophy makes me want to live in the moment. I want to leave all this behind and go make out with the, <laughs> out with the bike shed? Uh, don't you mean which? You mean behind? behind? I said what I said. You in? <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay, so while well, those two are speedrunning tetanus, Dooley has oh. had his heart broken again. 
After all that, they left the models behind. They didn't even take these in the end. Oh well, I'm sure we can use it kind of use for him. Yoink. A handful of wargaming models in the style of warring philosophers. No one wanted, it seems. In the box, a, a ballot box could prove useful. But Hole in the top. I'll... So Jeremy Snow stole the box. Oops. Okay, here's your stinking box. Is that what we're looking for? Oh, the sacred ballot box! I found the ballot box, everyone! What? Oh, myself! Now vote so we can crown the Maytime Witch and get the sacrifice underway! Wait, what? <laughs> and the votes are in! Candace, you're the new Maytime Witch! Uh, I'm so thrilled. Are your affairs in order after your parents signed the consent form? You know I'm getting a memory of hiding this box away back when. It was McQueen who stole it. <laughs> now that that's over, I need to get rid of this damn knife because it can be used to incriminate me or something. Hold this for me, will you, Mac... Uh, Mac... Spleen? McKay? McKing? Uh, boy, uh, hold this for me, boy. Ceremonial dagger. That's just more like a knife. This isn't as fancy as I expected. <laughs> Don't you remember? They get the freshmen to make them in year one metalworking. Twin Lakes is a weird ass city. Yeah. Because. Yep. Say it. Because I kept taking them to solve crimes. <laughs> it's okay, I remember. <laughs> uh, good to know that Francis has always been a little kleptomaniac. <laughs> My vote counted for nothing. Democracy is the worst. Jeez, I miss high school. My adult workplace has a strict no sacrifices policy. <laughs> Lead pencils. I'm just gonna take these now. What do we want? In a gross violation of standards and practices, we have a bundle of pencils that use actual lead and don't work very well as pencils. <laughs> yeah, because the cores of pencils are actually a mixture of clay and charcoal or something. Hmm. But it would be so proud if he hadn't been thrown into a volcano or to appease the fire gods, that is. Wait, 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 what do you do for a living again? <laughs> he just he just handed a, a dagger with his fingerprints over to a cop. <laughs> that Yolanda, uh, that Candace is uh, looking mighty tasty now. Uh, I don't care that I didn't win. I'm just so happy for putting myself forward for after all these years. Uh, oh, no. Anyways. Okay, here we go again. I can't believe we have to scam our way back here twice. Let me guess. I should be able to cut some of this material down using the knife. Here we go. Some old curtains in the school colors. Okay, and we combine it with that. I should be able to put together a mascot outfit out of these things. There we go. An outfit for our school ma mascot, the Horned Gods. He bleed for us all. He bleed for us all. I'm gonna get a bit tired of that. Yeah. Uh, that has to be actually went in sync accidentally or planned. Go so and yes. do, do a countdown. Mm. Okay, Dooley, you up for this? Right, put this on. No way. Is that? Yep, you're the Twin Lakes High <laughs> Horned Guard. Enjoy it. I'm so excited. I tried out for this every... I'm so excited. I tried out for this every year of high school. I know, buddy. I know. How do I look? Like a rip-off Freddy's... <laughs> Five Nights at Freddy's character. 
<laughs> Devilishly good. Now I just need Age you to somersault up to the top of that inhuman pyramid. So they'll let us take that springboard, okay? I guess. Should be easy enough, okay, Patrick? You trained for this? Something team years ago, maybe, but still. Okay, here goes nothing. <laughs> I did it! Look at me, detective. I'm on top of the world. Well done, buddy. We did it. We are complete. Take that, Jenny Walker. We did not need you to achieve the sacred symbol. <laughs> Nearly. Uh, just, and Dooley is... <laughs> but, uh, is yeah, Dooley going to end... He's, he's going for another dark side trip, isn't he? Oh, boy. Well, fuck it. We might as well grab the thing and leave. The Eye of Horus? The Eye of Horus? I can see a lot of hands reaching out of that detective. They're inviting us to join them, but I'm not entirely certain that's a great idea. I mean, it might be, I just don't know. Yes, the shape is complete. Ley lines below us quiver with energy. Skies darken, horrors uh, gathers overhead, ready to strike us all down with his Elfridge energies. I don't... I don't feel great about the direction this is taking. I better pick up the pace. Uh, how can we get them? Can I take the panels now? Yes, pathetic being, we are complete. Even now the end times crest the mountains at the edge of the world. In the coming world are screaming and crying and cheerleading. There is no need for a springboard. Thanks? Thanks? <laughs> I don't think I stay okay very much longer. I'll jump! No, we must hold the shape. Maintain the gate. We are the key. Nope. No way. Down I go. <laughs> well, at least Dooley's been sucked into the underworld again. Yeah, at least we <laughs> we can focus on the first world ending scenario now. Well, no wonder they never picked me to be on this squad. I have terrible balance. And nice to finally close that chapter of my life. And nice to not have inadvertently opened whatever portal they were talking about while getting what we needed. No, I think, no, I think my thing, my the lifelong closure thing, is more important. Yeah, sure, whatever, Dooley. Ugh, my heads. Those are miss cheerleading, but I do not miss the hive grinding or the portals to other worlds. Tell me about it. That's why I got out of it. Anyway, same thing next reunion? <laughs> yeah, of course. Go, Goatman. Go, Goatman. Okay. So I feel like uh, Glacier Boar should have been here. <laughs> Being a frozen goat and all. Hmm. Okay, and then I'm out of... Oh, hello, you're back. I'm crawling. I'm back again, eh? Okay, I forgive you. Let's go home, Patrick. Sorry, guy, but you're going home. You, you can't make me do nothing if you can't catch me. Mm -hmm. okay, do we build our trap here or something? Or do we need to lure him out somewhere? Pyramidal panels, rectangular, yellow, and hard like old cheese slices. Are we going to make a sandwich? out of all this stuff. Maybe. I... I hope not. Anyways. <laughs> let me look for another hint then, because I do not know where the hell... Uh, mm -hmm. Let's see. I have absolutely no idea what to possibly do now. Uh, trapping the monster... Mm hmm Yeah, box. Hinges. Okay. Mm hmm Oh, right. There are spare doors. Because you kind of need, well, the plates, <laughs> the walls of a cage to be connected with each other. Let's get these hinges off. Watch out, everyone! Huh? What's wrong? 
The doors, they unhinged. <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. Better than, better than your handle yoke. What was that? Nothing. <laughs> okay. I had a deja vu from me reading that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh no. I just spotted something in the box. Not Ash Ketchum's hat? Yeah. Okay. Uh... Oh, poor Ash. He was sacrificed to the, gro to the goat one. Oh. Oh. Yeah, you might be right, Rom. <laughs> and also, it's a stag. Okay. So, where do we even need to build this trap then? Hmm. Behind the bleachers? Monster small. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Try looking at a hint again. At this point, we've been doing this for a while. Yeah. Uh, trapping the monster. It's just ready to trap it. Find the box. It has to be sturdy. Yeah. Oh, okay. In the work. Apparently, there's a metal box supposed to be in the workshop that's incomplete. So you need to finish I... building the metal box. You missed the... Okay, there's... Oh, that thing there. Okay. It's... Mm-hmm. So... Uh, we need to complete it, though, before luring him in here. That means finding a hinge to reconnect that door and some metal panels to patch up those holes. Okay. I thought we had to build this thing out of nothing. <clears throat> Let's patch up this beast. Okay, we have a complete vessel. We just need to find some hinges to get the door working again. There. We can use these hinges to reattach the door to our trap, our hey, trap door. Don't you <laughs> open the trap door? I recognize that. Because there's something over down, there. down there. I think I know the show. Which one? Oh, what's it called again? It's a claymation one. I think it's called the trap door or something. Hmm. Let me actually do a, a look, a search on that right this moment. Uh, yeah, I, I know a good reminder would be re some months ago. At the trap door. Okay. What was called that? Uh, they have the, the misadventure of a group of monsters living in a castle. Okay, I'll give that a look after stream. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to open it though to trap the little guy. That's a a sheer joke. Oh yeah, of course. Souls can only get us so far in this case. Okay, it's complete. Including a way to trap and lock him in. I'm proud of us. What our kids didn't manage to finish this themselves. We just need to coat the thing in lead now so it blocks the time energy and we reverse the blast. Well, get the coloring. <laughs> Let's color this in. Oh, it's in Croft time, just Yosh, yosh, something. Why does it always look like I'm being held hostage? <laughs> I think it, 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 uh, I think this um, is out of accidental thing from Helian's end, not realizing I, when he puts the pictures. With <laughs> them just lining up accidentally. Want, you know, want to move you lot around a bit, <laughs> and it doesn't look like a hostage situation. <laughs> Later. <laughs> I will be holding my claw on his shoulder while holding an axe to his face. And it's ready to go. Uh oh. Well, now it's a complete, you know, complete of metal caskets, a complete lead coated caskets. Let's go back to Jeff and get him over here. Oh, Are yeah. we going to need to bread, uh, coat him over here with this? Yeah, I just remember him. Crumbling. Pens have a graphite. Yeah. Uh, so I think it might be graphite and lead? Mm. It might differ. Yeah, anyways. 
Uh, we read that. Sorry, guy, where you were going oh. home. Mm -hmm. Yep. How are we going to get him to the box? It's too heavy to move. We need a plan to get him there. Okay, with the box ready, let's use these to make a plan to chase him into the workshop. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, we need to make a plan to corral him into the sub. We can use this map and these models to plan a route that forces him into it. We need some help, though. Let's get Time Loop, the AV Club, Vince, Brickman, and... We have the models for one extra person. Jeremy, this pretty much owes us, and I'm... Yes, his cash flow is pretty much free. He's also a bird. Plus, it's hard to make new friends when you're older, especially if you spent the last while as a bird. It might do him good to stretch his wind... his legs. Well, okay, let's round them all up off camera and get to the minigame. <laughs> okay... So... Let's see. I'm presuming that whenever we put someone somewhere, he's going to move to other places. Okay, he's he bolts for the changing room then. Then he got out a window. Okay. He ran off the school grounds. Yep. There. Then someone there. Okay. Done someone there. Let's see. Oh, wait. <laughs> he bought. I mean, he got out a window. Um, Let's see. We only need to change one person, I think. Uh, there. The one by the changing room. There. It's full grounds. Let's see. Wait, who's chasing him out from under the bleed? No. Hmm. You had it right down there earlier, just... I think you don't need people by the two classrooms. That might seem a little unnecessary. Let's see. For the gym. Can't believe I'm going to say it is, but I hope everyone was too occupied with the sacrifice to notice him. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he tries to go out the first place he can, so there we go. And now I just have to close the door and. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong place for that. Wait, who are you supposed to be then? Yeah, then there was. Said who's who here? I'm guessing. Yep. Let's... Hmm. Yeah, maybe move one of the two people off the classrooms. Class one and two. He's, he's going out to the changing room this way, then. Hmm. Well, he gets out of a window. Then he escapes there. And then he's just going to go off the other way. Hmm. And then he just dives into the straight into the first class. Hmm. Actually, hold on. We don't have to send him out that way. So if instead we put someone here. Do this as a test. And they oh wait. There. Then they're going up to the roof. Oh. What? Wait, what? I missed a bit. Going back to the start. 
Okay, he didn't... Okay, if we remove someone from there... To there... There we go. Okay, hopefully he'll go to the roof access then. Yes, or not the other one. Okay. Yep, that actually worked. Man, this detective guy is really harshing my buzz. I can't rescue Dooley with him, him on my trail. Oh, I can hide in here. That should lose him. The dark. Case closed. Gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. That's like just this hasn't worked out it's so great for me. We have him. Hit the reverse beam, Professor. Here goes nothing. Enjoy early onset boldness. And high school graduates. Complete case six class of the Titans. Oh, that feels better. I don't know, it was sort of nice not being tired all the time. Oh yeah, my knees are suddenly very stiff again. Maybe we shouldn't have... Nope, my time machine, my eternal youth. Get your own. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> right, we need to get this guy somewhere safe. I know just the place, but we need a way to fly there. I came in. Uh, I came in the police copter. It's on the roof. I came in on the, in the police copter. All oh, the mayor is in the shop. Yep. So he is still. Yes, he, his wife is still the mayor. <laughs> uh, don't the police the need police the police copter? <laughs> nah, they're worried with crime. Told them to take the night off. You told crime. All of crime. Take the night off, yeah. Or else I was gonna bring them in. All of them. We'll probably get going. Then get to the chopper. <laughs> Christ. Where are we bringing him? This is ridiculous. Enjoy, Detective. This might be the only time we get to fly in one of these. Fine. Where where are we dumping his ass? Are we bringing him to the McDooleys? This is it. What, here above the ocean? Don't worry about it, just release it. Are we over the freaking train? <laughs> New Atlantis, 130 miles! <laughs> oh, hell hello, Nessie! Or Nigel, still a monster. Well, hey there, fella. A friend of mine said you needed a place to stay while you worked through some boundary issues. Sometime. Oh, hello. Well, here we are. Starting up the division again, officially this time. That's all the boxes moved in. There are a lot more boxes in the cup. Yep, fully moved back in. It's good to be home, work home, not real home, not like important home. The McKing. <laughs> I thought I heard some rats scurrying around in the basement. This isn't the basement. We're right next door to your office. Hey, stop now. I didn't come here to make fun of you. Even though I miss doing that, and for that reason and that reason alone, I missed having you around. So... I got you something. After all that stuff at the school, I spoke with the mayor and the chief of police, and we all agreed. The city's safe with you nerds looking into the stupid, not real, not crimes that are beneath a, a super cop like me. So, drum roll, here you go. And thus, the Dark Side Division was reinstated. <laughs> oh, oh, uh, 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 that, that's the very first screen of the first game, I think. <laughs> uh, and the fact that they are sort of speaking of these games as seasons, that has me hoping that they will continue to make these. Oh, and I hope so. <laughs> the gremlins at the, grave, not the graveyard, the scrapyard. 
But yeah, these it's games are fun. These games are just plain ass fun. What did it the computer? And we finished on time. Yeah. We, we still have the extras, but we can do, do we can do that another time. Oh yeah, yeah probably. probably. Yeah, we, we we do the extras on Thursday and weekend. Mm. Yeah, memory of Thomas Conway. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Anouk van der Slice. That's very obviously a Dutch name. Austin Cucumber. <laughs> okay, mm. I guess that name is definitely the kill is the captain. Uh, and uh, the class photo. I, I should keep a look out on the Kickstarter for... <clears throat> Or if they They're ever put up on the for a third in a game. <laughs> At the absolute least, I'm going to keep an eye on Spooky Doorway, the developers. Because they are just fun. They're just plain fun. <laughs> Raxa and her boyfriend or her ghost friend? Boy ghost? Friend? Ghost friend? I already said that one. I kind of wanted to see more of her as a third member of the team in this game, but maybe third time's the charm? Yeah, maybe. I'm <laughs> the the Tesla and enough. his pigeon <laughs> in the Tunnel of Love. I honestly was 100% expecting uh, <laughs> McQueen and Dooley to go through the Tunnel of Love together at some point or another. Fame. But, hey, Ron Gilbert. Would that be the Ron Gilbert from uh, Mon from uh, uh, of course of uh, Monkey Island as one of the backers, or just another say someone with the same name? I will not be. I kind of hope it is. But it does kind of have Monkey Island humor in a bit, in a way. Yeah. <laughs> another Dutch name there, Thijs van der Schagen. <laughs> That's where that thing ended up. No animals were harmed or jokes used in the making of this game. All events uh, depicted are within our, within our fictional, except for one, you know the one. We can't stop you pirating games, but know that every time you pirate a game, a company has microtransactions. All of come as to buy box and you're stolen a copy. Again. You were given consent to use your... Uh. <laughs> These guys have fun with their work, and it shows. Yeah. Uh, ooh. Yep. <laughs> Jeremy. <laughs> uh. Jeremy. Yeah, Jeremy's, Jeremy's wife is very, very confused. <laughs> oh. The boys are back in town. Credits watch division reinstated. And Missing yeah. Resume Dark Side, Twilight Years, De Druid's Delight, Unfair Dismissal, The Royal Fumble, Class of the Titans, and the bonus was our Ghost of Christmas Past, One Flew Into the Cuckoo's Nest, and Tales from the Dark Side. <laughs> okay, I'm curious about these two. The previous game also had a Christmas uh, episode, so I am still curious about how they'll work on that with a second time. But yeah, I definitely have to say Royal Fumble was my favorite of these. <laughs> Specifically because of El Julio and the wrong voice in them. Uh, I'll see you guys later. It was see you, Ram. Um, and night. thanks for joining. Thanks for joining. I'll see you later. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, but we'll get to those uh, yeah, on Thursday and on Saturday if need be. Wait, wait. I just realized I'm gonna I'm gonna double check for me. Mm. Hmm. Okay, first off though, I'm going to look for someone to raid. First day is 31st. Mm. Okay, it's so... Halloween. <laughs> okay, so that would be perfect timing if I, I very much hmm, we don't know how long they are, probably not as long as I... the others. But I doubt I we can finish all of them in one go. I got it. Double check something here. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Oh wait. Yeah. It, it should be uh, on Thursday. Though on Saints Eve would be on Saturday. Okay. So, 
not many separate for Saint Eve, only they are very hardcore Christian. Let's see. The heck is the Alfred Hitchcock Vertigo? Is are movies now a thing on Twitch or is this somehow a game? And of course it's a BRB moment, so we can't actually see. Um it was um, that get crazy lunatic? Or is that a could that be a game? I have no idea. I'll have to check on that myself. But first, people to possibly rate it is pretty busy, so let me narrow it down to a few. Uh, we have Invader Tori playing the Mortuary Assistant. And we have Azra Arcane playing Dead Space, probably the remake. And there's not really a third spooky game being streamed by the people I'm followed to. So, either of those two, or shall I take a pick? I say up to you. I say up to you, Captain. And also, people okay. before forget it, I did not chop off uh, Dervy's arms. <laughs> okay, let's go say hi to Azra then. So, copy the name, straight and paste. But before we started, of course, thank you everyone who is watching now or later. Uh, thank you, Jess. I see you've been lurking since this practically the start. I also see Sensei there. Hello. Say hi to Tatum. And yeah, thank you, Durvin, for joining. Ram again as well. And as always, oh. thank you, Drakir. You're welcome as all my race, my friend. And thank you all for joining. And yeah. Like I said, we'll continue slash finish this on Thursday, if not on Saturday. And yeah. Thank you, everyone else who may have been watching now or later. Let's get it right started. And yeah, thank you again for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, everyone. Sleep well. And watch out for dark side penguins. It's <laughs> a new one. Also <laughs> for Yandere uh, demons. Oh, God. <laughs>